Ini bukan kuku. Hey, I'm Zancy Real Talk fam. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we've got a fascinating topic to delve into, the rise of Skimoda, a sensational celebrity whose fame and fortune have captivated social media. Now, there's more to this story than meets the eye. Recently, there have been discussions within the online community about Skimoda's mental condition, with some professionals suggesting the possibility of Down syndrome. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on all the real talk we've got coming your way. As we explore Skimoda's extravagant lifestyle post his 3 million rand win, it's essential to address a concern that's been raised by many. Some psychologists and health workers suspect that Skimoda may have Down syndrome. It's a topic that adds a layer of complexity to the narrative. Mavuso culture and exploitation. Now, when we talk about the Mavuso culture and the women surrounding Skimoda, it's crucial to consider the ethical implications. One TikTok psychologist recently shed light on the matter, expressing concern about potential exploitation. She argued that instead of taking advantage of Skimoda, we should be focusing on ways to protect him. Dance and TikTok Challenge Shifting our focus to Skimoda's incredible dance moves that sparked a worldwide TikTok challenge, it's easy to get caught up in the excitement. But, as we celebrate his talent, we must also reflect on the responsibility that comes with this newfound fame, especially given the concerns about his mental condition. Nightlife and bookings with mental health considerations As Skimoda enjoys the nightlife and receives numerous bookings, it's important to approach this from a perspective that acknowledges his potential vulnerability. The same psychologists who expressed concern also emphasized the need for protection, urging the public to consider Skimoda's well-being in the midst of his popularity. Financial speculation and closing thoughts Addressing the speculation about Skimoda's financial future, we can't ignore the potential challenges he might face. However, with the consistent bookings from big artists and clubs, there seems to be a counterbalance. The big question is how we, as a society, can ensure that Skimoda is both celebrated for his talents and protected due to the potential challenges he might face. In conclusion, the story of Skimoda is multifaceted. It's not just about the fame, the money, or the dance moves. It's about how we, as a community, navigate these discussions with sensitivity and empathy, keeping in mind the potential challenges that someone like Skimoda might face. As always, let's keep the conversation respectful and open. What are your thoughts on his journey? I want to hear from you. Drop your comments down below, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to Mzancy Real Talk for more engaging discussions. Your support means the world to me. Until next time, keep it real, Mzancy.